It's been a hot topic nationwide, and Delmarva is going to be treated to a solar eclipse just a little less than a week from today. Our meteorologist Alex Seymour will show you how to create a pinhole solar eclipse viewer with supplies you probably have right at home. The solar eclipse is in just a few days here along the coast. Solar eclipse is on Monday. You need to be able to view it safely. If you don't have those eclipse glasses, I'm going to show you how to build one of these solar eclipse pinhole viewers. So what you're going to need, you'll need a cereal box, aluminum foil, a pair of scissors, tape, a piece of paper, and just a pencil to be able to trace out that piece of paper. So. First thing that we're actually going to do is we're actually going to cut off the sides of the cereal box. So we're going to do that right now. Yeah, so this solar eclipse that we're experiencing on Monday is the first one here on Delmarva. The first one that's eclipsed more than 50% of the sun since the solar eclipse back in the summer of 2017. It's a pretty rare experience to experience one. Our next total solar eclipse... Well, it's a long time away. It's not until 2079. So we just have to be happy with these partial solar eclipses. So we're building the pinhole viewer today. It's really just going to allow that light into the box and kind of just simulate a sun on a piece of paper at the bottom of the box. So there we go. We've got the top of the box cut off. So now what we're going to do, we're going to take our tape, just tape the center portion together. I'm going to take a second here to tape that portion so I actually messed up just a little bit here I taped this a little too soon we actually have to put a piece of paper in the bottom of this box so let me just reopen this box real real quick it's a DIY project sometimes that happens what you need to do is actually stick this cereal box on the bottom here and what you're going to do is you're going to actually trace on this piece of paper it can't be the brown bottom of the cereal box. It has to be a white bottom that actually is going to show that sunlight on it. So we're going to cut it out with our scissors and we're going to have to tape it onto the bottom. So here we go. Cut this out. So yeah, it's a pretty incredible sight. This solar eclipse is actually going to be able to be seen pretty much all across the United States. Here in Delmarva, though, as I said, it's only about 85 to 90% eclipse. Still a pretty surreal experience there's that piece of paper it's going to fit right into the bottom of the box we just have to put some tape on it so it actually stays still actually stays remains in the bottom so we're just going to fold this over make sure there's pieces of tape so here we go now what we're doing is taking this piece of paper putting it down all the way on the bottom of the box so that's the area where the sunlight is going to reflect off of it now we're going to tape the top of the box where that center section is and making sure that we have that opening there so there we go we got the opening we have the paper in the bottom of the box and now what we need is that aluminum foil i've already cut out a piece of the aluminum foil which the, it just needs to be big enough to cover one side of this we're going to just tape it all over just to make sure it doesn't really get moved around too much now we've got the aluminum foil on one side and now the last step is pretty simple you just need something sharp uh, a, something with a point poke the hole poke a hole into it so now that hole is where the sunlight is going to be shining through so what we're going to actually do is we're going to pull out my phone here and we're going to shine shine that light in it so if you can see from there you'll actually be able to watch that solar eclipse because as the sun is becoming more eclipsed that circle will become darker and darker and you'll get that little sunlight on the bottom. It's a perfect way to view the solar eclipse if you don't happen to have those glasses or other protective wear because you can't look at the sunlight directly. You need to make sure you have a safe way to view it. So enjoy the solar eclipse on Monday. Wow, thank you, Alex. That was super creative and fun. We actually have our own boxes of Lucky Charms that were turned into those pinhole viewers. And if Let, you look through, you can see that film on the end. Let's be very clear. We don't have, Alex made yes, these. Yes, we These did are the not. ones that Alex I made. Credit. I did not put any effort into this. <laughs> I am very happy that I have one now, though. You can see with the lights behind us, you can see how these work. You can make these at home. And remember, you can see that story again on coasttv.com if you want to go step by step and follow Alex along.